Hello everyone, Birgit Shannon here for Art BOP, your online magazine for everything related to the arts in the Bay of Plenty. I'm in Caddy Caddy, I'm on the corner of Hyde Street and State Highway 2. I'm here to have a chat to Julia Fulman, who has just opened a gallery here. Okay, we'll, we'll go inside now. Now I can see that Julia is very busy working, but we're going to interrupt her and say hi. Hi, hi. Julia. Welcome to the Waterford Gallery. Oh, great. Oh, we're so happy that you've opened a gallery. It's absolutely brilliant. Awesome. Would you mind um, just showing us around and maybe absolutely. telling us a little bit about some of the artists that you have here? Perfect. I'll start with this lady here. Right. This is a lady by the name of Helen Moshock. She's a, an illustrator and specialises in chalk and pastel portraits. Uh, she good. also does lots of different medias. She uh, used to be a school teacher, okay. so we're hopeful that uh, she might come in and do a few classes for us. Oh, wonderful. Or something like that. That would be wonderful. Next along here you'll have uh, some of the stuff that I do. Fantastic. I'm a big More fan of Julia's it. work. <laughs> Very nice and bright. Yeah. And, wow. So would you like to tell us a little bit about you and your art career? I'm more of a, a, a technical drawer, as you can probably see from the style that I do. Mm -hmm. I like vibrant colours, I like contrast, I like things that make you look happy when you first look at it, and then when you look at it a bit more, you maybe get a sense of uh, a hidden message, so I kind of like those two. Very yeah. good. Um, yeah, I choose subjects that I find are interesting. You know, most of them have some sort of personal, you know, like every artist, there's something personal attached to the, the particular subject that I choose. Anyone in particular that you would like to talk, tell us a bit about? One is, um, I call it some Auckland twilighting. The twilighting, as in, in the old days, people would say that as they got to a certain age, they'd start to twilight, where you know things aren't going generally like they used to go. Right. So when you first look at a painting like like this, you might be overcome by the vibrancy, by the busyness of it, and then when you look a bit more, you start to see that there's actually more to a city. Than when you first look at it. Right. So that's the intention. And I like art that you can look at several times, and every time you come back to it, you'll always find something a little bit different. So I kind of like shapes and I like block colours, and yeah, so that's. Excellent. And we'll keep moving around. Now we have an interesting fellow. Yeah, this is a, a, an artist by the name of John O'Meach. He's a, an Auckland artist, but his sister is from here. So they do a collaborative set of paintings every year. She does the background and he does the foreground. Oh. John O'Meach is a, a graphic designer based in Auckland and so we're quite lucky to have some of his work. Very this good. one he calls Angus. Angus, right. On the other side we've got Larry. Oh very good. This first painting here that she's got is about balancing life. Which I think is quite striking. She has a lot of cityscapes. She uses a lot of palette knife and a lot of other things. Then she does the more ethereal, elemental paintings. So she does a lot of things like that. And then she's a bit more out there with, uh, with some of the brighter colours. And you know, from far away, this painting looks absolutely flawless like everything and then you get up closer and you see that there's you know there's lines there's texture to it Very good. Cool. and of course we've got our local um, lizzie fisher who's a beautiful prolific painter here in caddy nice vibrant work she also does um, she's got a little print shop what she's been um, experimenting with digital art you know, coming into the, the, the new thing for the future and just really empowering everybody to see that it is possible to create something original, even if it's digital. Yes, yes, yeah. very good. And I uh, so just see here, there's a little bit more of Lizzie's yes, work this is, here. This is Lizzie as well, and this shows her political humour. Yes. Thank you for showing us Thank around. Um, wonderful gallery. Um, I'm sure you're going to do well. Yeah, uh, well, hopefully we'll get a few more modern artists. 
that are interested in coming and displaying their uh, their work for us. Yes, and I'll uh, I'll leave uh, Julia's details below so that everyone, if you'd like to come and uh, have your work at Julia's gallery, give her a call. Yeah, perfect. Thank Thanks you so coming. much. You're welcome. Bye.